Oh, you definitely sound like a guest. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Saturday. Um, Thomas just got here. It's uh, about one o'clock. We're gonna go get some lunch and uh, probably do a few things out and about. Uh, I think we're gonna go down to Player's Choice to show Thomas. Um, it's rainy. It's the Frankenstorm, which is actually just Hurricane Sandy. I think it is Hurricane as of today, though. So it's just not really hitting us. It's getting like the outskirts. But we're gonna go do some things, come back here, and probably play games since it's kind of nasty out today. We decided to bring Thomas over to Snooky's because everyone should be required by law to experience this restaurant. I did firecracker shrimp prep, although I wish I would have done the salmon BLT. Mal's enjoying it with a fork. Too hard to hold? Okay. And Thomas got the coastal burger, what Dan calls the best hamburger he's ever had. How was it? Thomas has never played Donkey Kong Country Returns, but he's a big fan of the original Donkey Kong Country series. So we are. I'm, I'm, I'm showing him the beauty of the game. You can blow! <laughs> you can blow! Oh, here we go. Oh man, we made steps. I don't remember this game all that well. I mean, it's been a while since I, I played it. Also, I had no idea it came out in 2010. Th that's crazy. This game is getting old. I am eagerly awaiting the next Donkey Kong Country game from Retro Studios. Crap. You get that crap, I'll get this banana. Going to get the coin. Got it. Get the jiggy. Got it. Yeah, that's monkey teamwork right there. For the record, I'm Donkey Kong, and uh, he's Diddy Kong. Oh, I made it. That was a big jump. There's probably something secret on the right there, but whatever. All right, I don't know how this works with two players. Can you control it? Yep. And I can control it? Of course. Great, well, <laughs> whatever. I'm sure that we'll, we will both make great judgments yeah. about when to jump. Nothing can go wrong. <laughs> okay. See, I was gonna wait. And then see, I, my, see, my thinking was jump on that guy's head right now. Man, that sits you all the way back here? I guess they don't expect you to die there. Oh my god, I already took a hit. Whee! Oh no, I can't. It's only you, because I was on your back. Weird. So now, so now you're stuck with my terrible judgments. Jump. Oh, that's the jump. Jump, jump. Jump. <laughs> jump. Okay, backseat driver. Oh, crazy, weird thing. I don't even care about them puzzle pieces. Foreground! How will we defeat Grand Total? <laughs> Man, I haven't played that in a long time. Background! Jumping these things, because they probably hurt. Oh, good crap! Taking the high road. Oh, yeah. Where are we going now? Friggin' moles, I can't, I can't even see them. I like how they kept the music the same. It's not that I'm not okay with, like, new music, but they're playing on the nostalgia factor and I'm okay with that. Alright, Og! Get that DK. Nope. <laughs> well, never mind then. <laughs> Og. Oh man, we almost finished the strawberry. We played Carcassonne after uh, we got through three worlds of uh, Donkey Kong Country Returns. And Mal got the highest score I've ever seen. 98. It's impressive. It's because of this stupid city, which extends forever. And she kept plugging people into it. And I was doing good over here, but then I got shut out. So, <laughs> did not work for me. But, uh, Thomas, did, you did pretty good for your first time. You had, 40, you had 42. What I have? 72. And Mal had 98. Man, you almost broke 100. I didn't, I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> also, look at all the candy I ate. You ate. We ate. This, Collect this collectively. This is mine. Thomas didn't have any. That's what know. you ate. I didn't spoil my dinner. Mm, I, I only had 
three heaths and three whoppers and two Kit Kats though, so that's... How are you so skinny? For dinner we decided to make a pizza and uh, we went to Walmart earlier and Mal picked up some some green peppers so we could put on here and uh, I asked them what they wanted and they wanted mushroom and green pepper. So I put that on the pizza and I was like, oh yeah, I went to Carrabba's uh, yesterday morning with my dad and we have a bunch of stuff left over. And I was like, do you guys want any of that? And I was like, I'll take a little chicken. But uh, no one jumped on the steak or the ravioli. So I did. This is the pizza. Uh, Mal's is over here, Thomas's is over here. Uh, we have uh, green pepper and mushroom on all of this. Mal's also got some chicken. And then I've got mushroom, but I've also got chicken, steak, and ravioli. And the ravioli is filled with uh, goat cheese and chicken. That's a lot of toppings, but uh, who knows? Maybe it'll be good. I'm going to call this like the Carrabba's Pizza, since really that's essentially what it is. So this is my finished product. Um, I'm going to give it a shot here. If Sagan doesn't try it first, no, buddy, no. It's the first time he's ever smelled steak. No, <coughs> no, here, no, go down, okay. Let's give this a shot. I don't know how the ravioli is going to do on this, but maybe it'll be all right. There's so many flavors. It's good though. And it's just meat. No, cat. No, 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 no. Mm. Overall, I call this a success. Also, Ascension. 64. 70. 86, which is good. I had, I had Mechina. There was one time where I had four Mechina constructs out at one time, and like that's pretty much all I bought the entire game. But it was available. Although we only ever saw like a few Void cards. We saw a lot of Enlightenment and a lot of monsters, but yeah, Mechina is a thing that will win you the game. After a quick game of Bananagrams, we're jumping into Brawl, which I played at PAX, e, uh, not PAX East, PAX Prime, and I hadn't played before that in years, and it, it was a lot of fun, so I'm glad we're playing now. I died, because we're doing random characters, and the uh, first game I got Olimar, so I lost, and now I got uh, DDD, and I'm done. Mao got Lucas, which is good for her, because that's her best character, and uh, Thomas got Mario. <laughs> and now it's one one life and one life, Mario's got zero, and Lucas is in 100, so I think it's uh, probably not gonna not gonna end well for Mal. Good luck, Mal. Thanks. You're gonna need it because he's yeah. You, I think you just oh nope nope. You're still alive. How are you still alive? Okay, now I'm interested in how this match will end. <laughs> Cam video. Okay, yeah, I think uh, you got hit by a ship. No, I got hit by a sticky bomb. Oh. I just wanted to update to say that I don't even like milk duds. But I ate some. Also, I, I died. Never mind. We're playing Galaga. I'm not playing Galaga. I, I edited Donkey Kong Country. They're taking turns playing Galaga, but um, it's it's low after 3 in the morning, so we'll probably play a few more games and then wrap it up. But thank you so much for watching, and as always, let's be back tomorrow, shall we? That was really good. Yay. That oh was really good. 63,000? That's like, I've never done that. Why bother? Wow.